Yo people, it's just me and it, yeah boy, and um, I'm just going to do a quick review on the, um, Chinook RC Helicopter, Zima FO 2, 2G, I can't remember, I think, 26G, something like that. Yeah, the controller's really good, you know, you've got throttle, that's really good, um, this, so when the top copter goes out of control, you just turn that, um, yeah, epic, it's quite easy, that's also back, forward, they've got different modes here, really good, yeah, so, um, the actual helicopter, um, right, it's not completely huge, but it is actually quite big and it flies perfectly. It creates a, quite a bit of draft, and um, but you know, it's alright. E epic in summer. <laughs> um, it makes a bit of noise, not too much. Um, so I'll just try and show you, I won't do a full flight, because you know, I'm on my phone and I don't want to pay, but um, when you turn it on, flashing lights go on, it's like, not dead, it's go, pick, turn the controller on, but the controller takes six AA batteries, so if I can just try and put my phone there, and um, I'm just gonna can't let really it like, fly at that one right now. So if I'll just spin the motor for you, I won't actually fly it properly. So um, Yeah, it's pretty easy to turn. It's quite loud. I bought this from Amazon. It's really good. And um, out of 10 overall, I'd probably rate it 8, 7, 7.5. Seven yeah, it's epic. So I'd recommend it. I bought it for 20 quid. Yeah, I'm in debt for 20 quid off my mum. But it's worth it. Um, one of the bad things is it takes 50, 60 minutes to charge, and um, <laughs> it's a USB cable. Pretty good. And um, um, yeah, it takes 50, 60 minutes to charge, but it flies for around seven minutes. But you can tell when it's gonna like it flies really high. And it's really like robust because like I've flown it, hit the ceiling, bounce up, down, up, down, and look, like, no damage whatsoever. So peace out, people. Hope you like this. Um, yeah, it's really good. Safe.